Good evening, Commanders. I'm going to click through this. We don't need to see that again. We've seen it every time we launch. Forget where I've actually uh, left my ship. This. Been promoted. <laughs> I'm squadron leader. Awesome. So let's uh, let's just give me. What do I have to do? Oh, we've got a pending application. Who's that? Merlin. Yeah, I'll let him. Okay, so he's uh, he's now a member again, which is good. Oh, he's not. Okay, okay. So we got to promote him. He's not a right change. Manage ranks, members. Promote him. Let's make him. There we go. He's an elder. Um, we've got on here then we've got some that we got Lex let's message him thousand light years away. How, how long did it take me to get there, do you reckon? Probably take me quite a while, I would have thought. Where is who's that? No, that's there he is. That's quite some way out, isn't it? Okay. Where is that? Where is he? That is Merlin, isn't it? That is. Yeah. Oh. Where are all my all my ships? Let's have a look. Why? What the hell are they over here? What's over here? Oh, that's where the um, yeah, that's where the two planets were colliding was. I'm guessing everybody's buggered off now, aren't they? Oh shit! There's no shipyard here. Um, okay, let's have a look. Let's see what we've got. There's still That's the galaxy map, don't want to see that. I think there's as many. Oh there is still loads. Lots of fleet carriers here still. Lovely job.
think. Well, that's got an atmosphere. And it's landable. So, landable. And it's got settlements. So, that like that type of ring there. And if it's got the complete circle, like that one there, means it's got an atmosphere. So, we've got a landable one with settlements. And it's got an atmosphere. Yeah. So these have got atmospheres, but aren't landable. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Let's go back to wherever I've got ships. Where we've got a ship over here, Shinrata. What's over there? Do we know? Ships there. That's my Phoenix. My Viper, sorry. Oh, that's going to be... Um, my Anaconda. That's my combat condo, isn't it? Let's go there. My combat's condo. Let's go head over there. We'll see... Uh, hey, Grapperman's on as well. Let's um, jumps. Uh, let's get out of here. is a pain in the ass. I don't know why it's not okay. My Discord's been playing up. I'm not altogether sure what's going on, but there we go. Okay. This goes. This is getting on my Tartars. Wait. He's in I'm in Mina. 195 light like weeks. So there's this mysterious um, 
Thargoid anomaly. Uh, I looked at it about 2,000 light years from my current location. Um, two squadron members are currently investigating it. Still not clear as to what it is. Or if it indeed is heading this direction. If you look at the system map, or well, the galaxy map at the moment, you can see where it roughly is. So this is the, here's the bubble here, pretty much. What we're looking at, it's um, down here. It's there. Um, yeah, so we don't know. Yeah, we don't know. We don't know where it is at the moment. It's um, that doesn't make any sense. Why am I focused on there? So I don't know. Who knows? Frame shift drive charging. So I haven't got much in the way of on this ship, especially any combat Four, capability. Three. Engage. It makes sense that I potentially head towards where my um, anaconda is and attempt to um, reach that, build that up a bit. Which is what I'm doing now. I've got two more jumps. Fuel scoop disengaged. Two more jumps to go. Sin. Uh, Frame shift drive charge. Sounds like a fun place. E class star, so there'll be no refueling there. Four, three, two, one. Engage. There may, however, be. Um, Uh, outpost there, who knows, who knows, maybe be some fleet carriers, never say never, no there's Rockall here, have a look, we got it, but there's two planets, two bodies, what do you reckon, nine, alright, oh, okay, let's have a look, what have we got here, what's in sin, fleet carriers, See, there we go, look, so these 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 here, they are landable, but there's no settlements on them at all. These ones are non-landable, but have an atmosphere. And these are fleet carriers, obviously. So that would suggest there may be an abundance of fleet carriers in the next system I'm going to. Which, which we'll see. So, well, bodies, let's check out the system. There we go. Dead load of uh, fleet carriers here, which is why there'll be some. I don't know why there's so many here. What's going on? I know that it's next to the system Sirius, which is where um, you need to be to get one of the engineers. So, potentially that's why they're all here. So look, a settlement here. So if we look at the system planetary map, we should see, there we go. There's a couple there. 
Greenland's Folly. There's quite a few settlements here. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Where's my... Where is my... Um... Pit docks. say where it is, which is annoying. All right. Well, it's going to be in the same system, so it's not a massive issue. Hmm. Which one's it going to be? At? We'll go to Hardwick, because I know I've been there a few times. And it's possibly going to be there. And it's the closest one by a few light seconds. Yes. So there's probably an abundance of fleet carriers in this system because another nearby system, Sirius, is where there is an engineer, Marco Quentz. Um, which means that that system is probably fully loaded up with fleet carriers. So, fleet carriers will then go to the next system, which is this one. When this becomes full up, they'll go to the one, another one near it, which is C. Um, so I wouldn't expect to see many aggressive commanders here. They'd be gankers or whatever, mainly because the engineer is not located in this system. That said, I didn't come across any aggressive types when I was doing uh, missions for Marco Quentz recently. Um, it's just something you've got to be mindful of. I mean, I used to have a real issue with griefers and gankers, and do you know what? I think I said before, I still don't like them. People who gank and grief are just getting cheap, cheap shots in. That's my opinion. However, with all that said and done, I have options. I can go. I can play in a private group. I can play in solo. Where's the fun in that? You know, the game is called Elite Dangerous for a reason. Um, I'm not the best combat pilot. Far from it. I'm more into exploration and uh, trade. Uh, but maybe, maybe I need to improve in combat um, like I say if, I, if it was a real issue I'd just stick to flying in uh, solo or a private group there we have options right so about 1800 light seconds away from my destination. Um, what have we got here? Mark, ED Market Connector is showing me, I'm 11 light years from Seoul. I don't have a permit for that. I need to, um, I need to do some more Federation missions to unlock the permit for Seoul. Um, I think I should do that. What's my rank at the moment? What is my rank with the Federation? So I am a recruit. Should we seek out some, uh, let's seek out some Federation um, mission types 
we'll try and boost that. I'll boost that uh, so I can unlock the permits for Sol. Then I can get to see Earth and Mars and all that shiz. So basically, you, you rank up with your with, with the power by doing missions specifically for either uh, the Federation or the Empire, etc. Um, and as you rank up, you get different. The Federation, I think it's the Federation. I'll double check later on. But you need to be the rank of Petty Officer. And that grants you a permit for SAR. Um, which is kind of cool. Which is kind of cool. So, what I'll do, I will dock at this station. I'll see what missions I can do in and around. I'll we'll try and rank, improve my rank with the with the Federation. I think it's Federation. It might be Empire. I'll double check. I'll double check. Why is my night vision on still? Don't need it. There we go. Uh, Blake on Bravo Two Loop Sierra. Station services are on standby for your arrival, Commander. So it's quite busy around here. There's quite a few ships. Okay, Commander. Please land on pad platform. One four. Pad number 14. We have to reduce the speed down to less than 100 kilometers an hour. Just bringing the speed down there. So if I do it to about 25%, that should be. There we go, that should be fine. I'm just below the speed limits. Line myself up with the mail slots. I can see one four in the distance there. Okay. Landing gear down. We're bringing it into land. Landing gear deployed. Slowly bringing it in. There we go. This would almost be textbook. Not done one of these ones in a long time. There we go. And you want to line it up until you get the blues there. Wait, there we go. There we go. We'll bring it down. Superb. Right, back in a second, just gonna check and see. One second. Yeah, so it's the Federation rank of Petty Officer I need to achieve. Let's see if there's any missions here. I don't know if this is a Federation station. Uh, it's a two. It's the power. Zachary Hudson, that might be some indication. I think he's Empire. I don't know exactly how to Federation. That's cool. That's cool. Cool. Let's 
good. That's good. If I can find some Federation missions here. We'll have a look. Federation. So icons of that. I don't want that one in. I want that one. That one, that one, that one, and that one. I don't want anything else, really. It's linked to ones that I need to do. Yeah, we can do that one. That'd be nice to do. We'll do that one. missions you need to do that's what you need to get um, one store ship this would be my what cargo have I got I just sell some stuff then what watch the turtles sell them all we care. This could be interesting because um, I can't dock an anaconda. Focus. Come on, what are you taking so long for? This crashes, I'm calling it a night. Thank you. Hello. I need to come out, yeah, I need to um, complete promotion missions. I think they're the, the follow-on missions. Yeah. So I've got miles. I've got one, two, three more. Three more. Yeah. No, we'll do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Accept the mission. What a pillock. Honestly, you're such a bell sometimes. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, detached, this one is a bit of a tricky one to. The anaconda, I mean, the, the, the cockpit is at the top of it. So really, and it's pretty flat on top, so what you need to do, as so I've been told, is try and keep the anaconda near the top. And when you've got the... Um, not 
part of the top. That's alright, that's no big deal. Too near the top. Too near the top. Okay, so we'll get out of here. There might be some combat zones nearby. There might be some combat in it, so it's My game glass is playing up. It really bugs me, it does. Frameshift drive charging. Four, three, two, one, engage. So that's so. Oh, that's fine. So I've got Game Glass, fantastic bit of kit. I've got two old tablets and it works really well, but it does keep dropping out. I don't know why that is. Um, it's a bit of a pain, but there we go. What have we got here? Let's have a look. Have we got any identify signals? Signal. Are there any? No. Hoping to find some has reses or something. There's nothing. Alright, let's go to. Where should we go? Let's try. Lung. Lung sounds like it could be a good place. Head towards Lung and then we'll head back to Procyon. There was a takedown mission there. Of course, this was another Federation superpower. Right. Do some missions there, Federation wise. So essentially what you do is you do missions for a superpower and then every so often you'll get a uh, a follow-on mission and it, it's it's that follow-on mission that will give you your promotion the, the, the beauty is if you've done lots of follow-on if you've done lots of missions for the federation not yet done a follow-on mission doesn't matter it, it will build up the credits essentially that you've accrued and as and when you do a follow-up mission, it will add all those credits to your rank. So you can sometimes rank you go up by two or three ranks in one hit, um, depending on how many you've done in the past. Right, so we want to do here. We're gonna... So that's permit locks. Van man's stuff. <laughs> Whoa, 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 look, we've got lots here. I think if we go to the... Uh, where's the nav beacon? Let's do this. We'll also... Just going to scan... Uh, we might have something here. We'll go to the nav beacon, we'll scan it. This might highlight some areas where I can uh, get some more combat. Look how much I've got on this. I've got yeah, bio shield generator. I don't think I've got any collector icon. No, this is purely combat. Well, I need to get some missile boosts on this one and some um, not missile boosts, laser laser boosts. Get the range boosted. It means I can stay out of harm's way whilst I take down shields, which would be fantastic. Okay.
Come on now, Bacon. Come to me. So I've got shield cells in this, but basically means if I get um if my shields go down low, I can deploy a shield cell, it boosts your heat. So you then deploy a heat sink straight away pretty much. Which counters the, the heat increase. Um Thankfully I have skin glass stuff, so I I can do it all without having to sort of um, keep changing stuff, which is all good. It's all sort of like, yeah, it's all touch screen. And it's relatively cheap. Lots of good stuff on the PC side of things. Voice attack, which is fantastic, and I'll be using that more. Um, now I've got a VR headset. Um, yeah, it's all good. All good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And Bosch. Okie dokie. And I mean, we may be lucky. I may have some enemy combatants near this, uh, near this, um, is this thing, Nav Beacon. That's all scanned for. Let's have a look. See what we've got here. Scan detected. Who's scanning me? Torville's shield. Ah, there's Torville's shield. He's a master. Now, the fact he's scanning me would suggest he is potentially wanted. Yes. Someone else is scanning me. Orville's shield. Yeah, it's all sh Okay, so we have got. Right, he's a master, and he's in a courier. I might regret this. We've got, we've got somebody in a viper. Now, scan detected. He's a federal agent. I'm not going to go for him. I'm not going to go for him. I still think this Torville. Oh, he's gone. There's someone on a Cobra, actually. Robert's guest. Earth defense fleet. No, I'm not going to attack him. That'll be another one in a. Have defence fleet, yeah, we'll leave him alone. Rob a guest. I mean a viper. It's not deadly. Yeah, they're all um yeah. This person scan me. Normally, if they scan you, it means they're scumbags. All right. Where is he? Where's? There we go. He's the same rank as me, so I can probably. Yeah, wanted.
Yes, yes. Here we go, here we go. Warning, temperature critical. Where's he gone? There he is. Has he been engaged by somebody else? I think he is. Target shields online. Ah, chicken shit. Why are these not? Why can't I change? Is it because I deployed? Or because I deployed? Scan detected. Why does it not let me change those? I've got turreted ones, haven't I? I don't know. I thought I had. Oh well. But why is that not working? Because I can look, they are turrets. Oh they're gimbaled, aren't they? They're gimbaled. Yes, they're gimbaled. That's why it's forward fire only. Oh well. Competition, that's a yeah. Who have we got here? John Crichton. Loken. We'll have a look. Let's, have a, let's get back to this, shall we? He's clean. Frameship charge detected. Think so. Novice. Get rid of him. His wing mate attacking me. Target destroyed. 
good. We like to see. That one. Competent. Clean. Yeah, don't be attacking people with a clean record. So yeah, because I got gimbal weapons, I can't do the auto fire thing. Um, it does mean it will automatically lock in. It will automatically lock on to the uh, target, which is good. H is an expert. An expert in what? They're okay. Primo Jordan. Also clean. Also clean. Another Cobra. Flebus. There we go, Flebus. Harmless. There we go, we'll take him out. What's that? Who's that? Zach. Right, Zach has just scammed me, so we'll we will look for Zach. Zach is a master. Um, Zach will probably he's a Diamondback Scout. He's firing all sorts of countermeasures. Under attack. Hopefully. There we go. Right, the uh, system authority ships will go for him. Good. He was a master, so that's who's scanning me now. over here Python Incoming mission critical message What mission critical message delivery contract Yeah I am No no Who will stay A dog, but who keeps scanning me? Battle Beermeister. Battle Beermeister, he sounds like a fun guy. He's, he's a Diamondback Explorer. He's, he's in a DBX. Let's see. There we go. Let's bring his shields down. Target 
He's gonna run away. He's gonna run away. Not if we can help it. Warning. Yeah. Got him. Got him. What materials are? It's got nothing really. Floor, focus. Yeah. Well, there's a few. That's right, let's head over to this um, station because I've got a fair bit there. Hopkins Landing, let's go there. That looks like a fun place to be. So, compromised nav beacons are normally quite good for that sort of thing. Um, That's our has resis. Once we're in, uh, once we're in um, Super Bruce, we'll look for the has resis. So, have we got? No. They tend to be around. Um, have you upgraded? So, there might be some. Salvage we had there, um, but it's quite a few um, settlements. Bring a shame, can't it's loop a shame. Sorry, loop a shame. Loop of shame. But yeah, has reses, um, generally speaking, are near um, rings, rings planets, um, hazardous resort resource sites. So where people go mining, um, you get quite a lot of opportunities for uh, 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 sort of bounties, that sort of thing. You've coded in missions. Um, yeah, there could be some stuff there, but at the moment I'm just, uh, I'm just wanting to, I've got some bounties to hand in. Um, if there's any follow-on missions, the Federation, that's what I want to do, really. Oh, come on, they're going too fast, too fast, too fast, too fast. That's fine. Where's the arrows? If you target the sh uh, station. And see some arrows which point you in the direction of the entrance. Not easy to see when it's the orange one. Um, yeah. Not this side. It's gonna be. Honestly, eyes of a mare trying to find these bloody things. Oh, shut your face. There we go. Here it is. It's on my. Yeah, fine, okay. Access granted. Proceed to landing pad two. 25. At 25. And again, when you go to dock in these ones. Right, so the reticule here has got like a little notch halfway up. Now, I've been told what you need to do is try and keep that notch in line with the, with the green lights or the arrow. Just above that, so let's keep it about halfway. Oh, yeah, it didn't really work, did it? Right, 25. Where's 25? 
Yeah, okay. Lighting gear deployed. The Anaconda's quite a difficult ship to dock because it is so big. Not as bad as the T-10 though, which is massive. We know. Right, okay. Docking confirmed. You may disembark when ready. Could Thank you very you. much. So we've got to do some advanced maintenance for repair watches. Uh, contacts, admin contacts. I've got some bounties to hand in. Yeah, that's cool. So that's more money my way. Um, mission board. So look, we want to look at, we don't want these two. So we don't want those. We want that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Let's see what they've got here. Yeah, so they've got loads of uh, they've got loads of these ones here. Okay. And they've also got infiltrating missions. Green party of long. If you do some of these, you'll probably end up getting follow-on missions to uh, which give you promotion. Say, so, but in the and it's those follow-on missions that boost your rank. But it's based on how many other Federation type things you've done. So, I've done quite a few of these for the Federation, which is good. It means when I do a follow-on mission for the Federation. I should rank up by hopefully two or three. We got here. We got transportation missions. Fourteen. Oh, there we go. Look, fourteen units. This is a federation. This is the link I was telling you about. I need to get fourteen units of Galite. So I'm going to do this. Um, how much space have I got? Why? Cargo. Fly responsibly. Ensure you complete docking procedures within the allotted time window. So I, I haven't got any cargo, which is annoying. It's not a problem. It's not a problem. What I will do. I will do, I'll... Why does I... Oh, that's gone. That's not enough, I think. Oh, it's not right. I'm sure I selected that. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to have to do some more missions, then I'll get that again. Chaos, my old friend, how are you? Yeah, not too bad, mate. Not too bad. Just trying to uh, 
improve my ranking with the Federal Navy so I can unlock my soul permit. Where is it? G9949. Where is G9949? That is. Yeah, I, th I think, I mean, I haven't done any follow-on missions for quite a while, but I have been doing lots of missions that are potentially for the Federation. So, I'm thinking, at the moment, I'm currently a recruit. Um, but I've got a feeling that this is going to um, have increased a bit once I do a follow-on mission, which I'm about to do, because I found a, fo a Federal Navy mission, which is to basically just kill one pirate. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I can do that, give that a try, next jump, the only downside is I've got to actually leave this station manually, and you know what I'm like with landings and uh, takeoffs. What are you up to then? Jesus, that was awful. Warning, access to this station is by authorization only, Commander. Exit this facility immediately. Oh, come on. I can't get out. Stuck. Right. Jesus Christ. That was bloody awful. Um Are the transfers open now? I wasn't too sure if they were open yet. I thought you were definitely you were going to move it over as and when it becomes available. Mission objective detected. Incoming mission critical message. Fuel scooping. Fuel scooping complete. Okay. We want to go to. That's a rest site. So, well, there's plenty of ring sites here. Let's have a look. What have we got here then? There we go. There was one there. What's one there?
This is ridiculous. I thought I saw a has res site there. We're going to go the old fashioned way. So it's going to be a ringed planet. That'll be this one potentially. Let's go here. Oh, okay, so you're, you're actually tempted to um, swap them over. I was chatting to another one of the uh, bids yesterday. Um, who's literally just finished building a PC, uh, and they are looking at transferring their um, uh, account over to PC. But what they want to do for because they have actually um, gained some credits on the PC side of things. So what they want to do is find a way of transferring those credits onto a fleet carrier, then transferring their account over and then transferring those credits back, which I can understand why. It's 120 million credits. Um, every little helps, doesn't it? So. See, I'm kicking myself, because um, if I just waited a year, I could have transferred all my progress over onto PC. But I didn't. I had to start from scratch, um, and I've made progress. I have, you know, I've, I'm sort of pretty much where I was beforehand. Um, it's just, uh, yeah, just to have to do all the grind again, which is a bit of a pain. But there we go. It's one of those things. Uh, There's got to be. There we go. Um, I'm not going to go hazard. I'm going to go to the high extraction because all I want to do is kill a pirate. One pirate, all I need. One pirates. Roger. He's a pirate. That's fine, that's what I wanted. That is what I wanted, but he's yeah, I've got a have I got a I don't think I've got a um, interdict on this. It's saying I've got an interdictor. No, I haven't. All right, we'll go here. That's good. There's some pirates around, which is just what I want to see. Let's drop out of cruise in a second. Right. We're going to hang around here for a bit. 
Uh, we're still quite some way out from the extraction site. So at the moment, my rank um, with them is recruit. Let's see what level I get to. Oh, that's fine, that's just a miner. There's quite a few mining ships out at the moment. And then we've got a few incoming. An anaconda there, Justin Hayes. What is he? Pirates, he's in a wing of three. I'm... Back Fez. this one here, Lee Rollin, he's our team, might regret this, not on this ship, no, what I sent out to do. All I need to do is a, a one pirate. Mission successful. I've got to hand back to Hopkins. Hopkins, wherever it is. Also got some fines there because I got stuck in the bloody mail slot. Just want to see how much it boosts my rank by. Um, I'm, re I'm hoping at least a couple of levels. We'll see. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't bother putting um, Fighter Bay in this. It's. Um, yeah, this is a very, very basic. I, I could have done. Um, now I've got the power unlock, which is good. Um, yeah, I know. We'll soon find out. Pay a fine first. I don't know how I got it so wrong. Ridiculous. I, was, I thought I'd line it up just right. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, what I, the way I tend to do the um, the Hazres sites is that I will keep an eye out for ships that are under attack. It's a bit of a cop-out, really. And then just get a couple of hits on it, so at least I can get the kill. Um... 
or if I've got some friendlies, I will shoot something and then lead them towards the friendlies because they will um, invariably jump in and get, you know assist. I wouldn't normally take on a, a wing of three by myself, especially when they're all sort of masters. But I only needed the one kill to get this uh, federal contract. So uh, hopefully, hopefully, let's say we'll see how well I've done when I um, go and hand this in once I pay off me fine for smashing into the side of the uh, Coriolis. Right, where is the arrow to point in this way? ships I see ships where is it I don't miss that god damn you Yeah, 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 yeah. Make your way to landing pad number three, Niner. Three, Niner. Scan detected. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't shoot me out of the sky. Three, nine. Right. That's perfect, I think. Not quite. Oh! God damn it. That's what I was looking at. I do. It's got the arrows. But I couldn't see him. And even then, when I could see him, it pointed me in the wrong place. I always look for the arrows. Always have done. Never mind. Yeah. Always look at the arrows. Always target the Coriolis. Right, let's go and pay the fine. Right, so. Fines. All fines come. That's not too bad. There we go. That's that sorted. How much have I got in the way of bounties? To, uh, bounty vouchers. Yeah. Thank you very much. Right, let's see what I've got by means of a promotion. What do I want? What do I want? I'll scrape in the top there, I think. Uh, do you know what? I want these. Ooh. So I'm now a cadet. What does that mean in terms of oh, just the one? I need to go midshipman. I need two more ranks. Never mind. Never mind. 
what missions have they got here? Any more, any more follow-on missions? Probably not here, actually. So I want that, 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 that. Let's have a look. No, no more. No more promotion missions. Oh well. There will be some more at some point. What have I got in the way of... Uh, We got in the way of here. Where are we? Status. Ah, see, look, I've already got 100% cadet. So if I do another follow on mission, that will take me to midshipman. That's good. That's good. Right. I'll be on this now for an hour and 20. Um, I am going to call it a night, I think. Um, yeah. My mission to get promotion to mid of the officer will continue. Uh, chaos, my friends. I will catch you later. I definitely think you need to uh, do the transfer. You won't look back. You won't look back. Catch you later, mate. Take it easy.